All right, guys, I got the easiest way to top dress your lawn, your green, your yard, whatever you wanna call it. I'm gonna show you how to do it. Uh, you need one specific thing, and that is a spreader that has a big hole in it. Um, and then you need some sand. I know there's a lot of controversy. Should you top dress with sand or compost, whatever? Everything I've read said it never hurts to top dress with sand. It's soft, it holds moisture well. As long as you're not putting too much on, you should be in good shape. So uh, check it out. All right, so here we have it. This is the Earthway commercial high output uh, spreader. Thing's pretty rugged. I mean, look at those tires. They could be tractor tires. They're bigger than my uh, mower tires. Anyway, here's what you gotta be looking for. Open this setting all the way up. That hole, you can see it's pretty big. That's the only thing that's gonna let sand through. Now you can buy finer sand, um, but this I got masonry sand and it's nice and thin, but it still has some particles in it. Um, but but uh, real nice stuff. You want it to be dry, obviously. Uh, this got a little moist. I did have a tarp over it all night, but uh, anyway, fill this sucker up and uh, then I'll show you the technique. Now that I have it filled up, you're gonna use a hoe, any type of hoe. You wouldn't even have to use a hoe, but this is nice because you can use it to scoop it. What's gonna happen is this is gonna clump at the bottom of this. And so as I'm walking with it wide open, I'm gonna be tapping on this. You don't wanna fill it too full, but you tap it just like this and it causes the whole thing to vibrate and it's gonna cause the sand to come out really nice and you're gonna cover your area, the whole area with it. <clears throat> and then you're gonna brush it in. So check it out. Right, so then you're gonna to wanna to take a broom. You wanna broom everything in uh, just real lightly. This is for real fine grass, this is for bent grass. Uh, if you're doing it with other grass, you probably don't even need to rake it in. It's gonna fall down, down between everything and uh, shouldn't be too bad. Uh, but you can brush it in, you can rake it in. I'm brushing it in because this is brand new grass and I don't wanna damage it too much. All right, the final thing you wanna do is brush it in. Any brush will work. Uh, just do it lightly. This is new grass that I'm working on. If you're working with uh, you know, other grass, you can either make your own float thing, uh, but sand's so thin, it'll fall down through the grass pretty well. Um, again, this is for my green area, so this is with real fine grass. Uh, but if you wanna do larger areas, you can get one of these pull behind things um, that opens up real wide. You're gonna have to tap it though to get that sand to fall through, but just tap, tap, tap. Give it a little tappy, Happy Gilmore style, and uh, um, give it a whirl. Yeah, hopefully this is helpful. An easy way to top dress with sand uh, on real low cut grass.